What's up, gamers? All right, so we're playing some more Astral Chain after... I think the last time we touched this game was like two months ago because Spencer uh, kind of recorded like 75 episodes in one night, so... <laughs> Um, let me see. I think we're on this one. Keep it turned up. It's alright. Turning this off. Uh -huh. The volume shall return. I just don't want there to be an echo. Alright, we're good. We're... There's not even any music anymore. There is. It's just quiet. Can you hand me the Cheez-Its, please? Oh my god. Ah, uh, here you go. I am baby. Monkey. So we just finished, oh yeah, this part. <laughs> this is the, uh, uh, what is it, Syndrome's room from The Incredibles. It kind just... of is, it's like... Yeah, it's, I mean, come on. Like, what, what's the point of building this big room? Like, just freaking put a TV in some, like, basement. You don't to need talk to... talk with the Seeker of Wealth, obviously. You don't need to build all of this. Who are the other two? I don't know. <laughs> Nobody knows. Seek of glory. Is the screen like floating off the wall? Because it seems like a lot of effort just to. You remember that this is a uh, very advanced society. Mm hmm. But at the same time, it seems like a lot of effort just to talk to someone. Mm. Seeker of power. It's like once you seek wealth, you just automatically seek power. Yeah. Oh, they cursed. Yosef. Ooh, it's Dr. Tesla. <laughs> um, yeah, this is a cutscene that's certainly happening. It certainly is, but it's important because exposition. Yeah, this game kind of... I don't like how it does its exposition. Because it's literally Mom. just like... What the frick is this guy? Stupid... Weird haircut ass grandpa. <laughs> Alright, so now we're playing File 4, which I guess is. Mm. Wait, get a burger. Burger. The Jimmy Neutron break room? Nice. <laughs> Repeat, all commanders, immediately come to the room. Me. Burger. <laughs> Not just in a. Try our burger. What kind of burger? An exclusive burger. Oh, it's Kirby Machine. Order a Kirby. What? What, you can't buy a burger? Uh, no, it's only on the middle one that we can do stuff, and it's just a drink one. <laughs> Order a Kirby. I can't get Borger. There's uh, one that you can do in a later area of the game that I'm not going to talk about because it's my favorite part of the game. Um... But no, there's a. That's glass not the door, there. you freak. Freak off! <laughs> That's like a Windex commercial right there. <laughs> Thunk. Bonk. Mm. Shout out to when I broke the glass at the YMCA and during my like eighth grade birthday party. What? So okay, so I was watching like a racquetball game and I was carrying like, I don't even remember what there was like carrying something, and I ran into the glass near the YMCA and I cracked it. It was like. I don't know how I cracked it that way, but... She has the... Uh, uh, it's, it's Fire Emblem character that... 0.5 uh, suit Samus. Naga. It's the Naga outfit with just uh, the strip in the middle. Yeah, I want her to strip in the middle. Shut up. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, and then Bella Delphine gives us the rundown. Oh, yeah, I forgot about this. She's a cool character. Oh yeah, didn't we say we we're calling her like breadstick or something? Oh yeah, <laughs> <laughs> that took me a quick second, but you know what? Breadstick Delphine. There we go. Full name. I don't remember what her full name is. <laughs> zoom in. <laughs> I was gonna say that was a very dramatic zoom for everyone is standing there just randomly. So why do we salute? Cause do police salute? It's like it's like the uh, the TikTok trend where everyone like just salutes as soon as any like military or police officer person exists. I didn't know that. I know in China police do salute. Yeah, that's China. Like no one lives in China. Oh, did we talk to this guy already? All those animals are extinct. Oh. 
Yeah. Nice. Koalas are dead, by the way. Good. Fre koalas are freaking useless animals. They kind of are. They just nap and scream. I mean, so I'm like a little sibling. Yep. <laughs> Alright. I have to get to where we're going. But I want to get my gamer energy. Cheez Its are temporary commentaries forever. <laughs> Ready to go? Nope. <laughs> Me and my Jesus in peace. Hey, do you still have that Ford 1997 Corolla? Yeah. Are you interested? No. <laughs> <laughs> All right, real quick. Back to your. Do you have any other misadventures of the Y? Oh my God. So I, yeah, I have a lot of misadventures at the Y. We're talking about the YMCA. So, I used to go to the summer camp at the Y. Do you do summer camps? How you, well, okay, so they had, like, a summer care program that my parents put me in when they were, when I was, like, in elementary school. And they had, we had, like, this entire underground Lego trading scene. No. It was great. But there was one guy named Keith who was, like, really just freaking stupid all the time. And he accused me of bullying him because I accidentally tripped over his chair when he scooted back. And it, like, hurt me more than it hurt him. And he went up to the teacher and said that I was bullying him. So that's, like, really? a, good, a good thing of Keith. Um, so it was, like, the very last day. And we went to these, like... We went on some field trip, like, the week before to, like, some place that had a souvenir shop. Don't remember where. And I got this, like, $10, like, really cool-looking replica of a diamond or some gemstone. Okay. And I, Keith was like, hey, that's a really cool diamond. Um, I'll trade you these, like, six Lego minifigures for it. And I'm like, okay, I don't have the diamond today, but I can give it to you tomorrow. And that was the last day of the summer that I was going to be there. So I just scammed the kid. So that felt good. <laughs> wow. That's, like, the only person I've ever scammed. But Keith deserved it, so it was worth it. Black hat. All right, we're looking for a guy with an orange Keith jacket and a fat, black hat. And he had a monobrow. Huh. <laughs> Camps that big places like that put on are very annoying. It's not this woman. Mm. Just slice her in half. That'll... It wasn't really a camp. It was more of like a daycare thing. Like a, an advanced daycare. Let me see. I am remembering the controls for this as <laughs> we go along here. Honestly, the YMCA camp wasn't even the worst. I didn't like it as a kid, but like we went to the pool back when that was still a thing every like Tuesday and Thursday, so it was really fun. I think I remember where this guy is. So we're basically just hunting a guy down because the other guy sucks at his job and lost him. <laughs> Story of my life, really. I think we go down there in a later mission. Let's see. So just like downtown New York, like why is everything blue? What did they do to this world? Uh, well, it's kind of also we can't cross the street because that would be jaywalking. <laughs> wow, this game is a great moral guide. Don't jaywalk unless you're jaywalking like a grandma across the street. <laughs> oh, you haven't seen me bop yet, have you? Uh, what? Oh. The frick was that? What do you mean? Uh, did I just get points taken away because I crossed at the wrong time? <laughs> Excuse me. You game. didn't watch the the street crossing sign. You have to do better than that. Oh, wow. All right then. Hey, this really is China. You have a social credit score. Shut. Ooh, go to get a sandwich from back there. Where? At Subway. Dang it, they're closed. <laughs> Here, watch this. Ready? So you see all... Did you see all those cans I've been picking up? Wow, this <laughs> game is a great moral teacher. <laughs> this is just like life lessons with uh, Hayato. Is that... Yeah, that is what we changed his name to. <laughs> I remember now. Because uh, we saw it and we like started laughing. <laughs> I'll just assassinate her. See, yep. I really want to do things. I just go assassinate everyone. I just cured her, because apparently when we use our legions, 
We can fix like the radiation disease that people get, which oh. is interesting. See, I feel like you'd make a lot more money as a hospital than as a police force. Well, other people can't see it. It's just, you know. Mm -hmm. So you claim that it's healing magic and just eat the disease out of their bodies. Then get executed. Yeah, no, but you might be burned for being a witch, but it's worth it. It's worth it, guys, I swear! And then if anyone tries to burn you at the stake, then you just stab them with your legion. Mm -hmm. It's easy. Alright. Oh my god, I saw like a Reddit question a few days ago that was like... Just a single question? Well, it was like an Ask Reddit thing. It was like, girls of Reddit... When guys aren't around, what do you really think about the Salem Witch Trials of 1648? Like, Alright, there's one person that I think we get to beat up because they think that the person that we're showing them... Oh yeah, these guys. Didn't we kick their butts the other day? I don't know. The other day was two months ago, Spencer. <laughs> oh yeah, these motherfuckers. <laughs> this doesn't seem like a fair fight. It this, isn't, that's the fun part. This is like some random, like... <laughs> Random guys attack a stand user who also carries a big ass sword with him. Like, oh, he has a pipe, that's why. What? Is <laughs> Where? Why am I on. This guy is Molotov cocktails! Oh <laughs> Mother fricker! This is insane. Why do you have Molotovs? Molotov. Why is he trying to block with the Molotov? That seems like a bad idea. <laughs> I was going to say, that's, that's probably the opposite of how they're supposed to be used. I can't move because I keep have? getting set on fire. Too many is the answer. Yes, let me just pull some more fire out of my infinite Molotov pocket. Ha, ha, ha. Ha, ha, all right. Foo. This ain't their usual spot. We usually hang around the Ark Mall. Did you say Darth Mall? Darth Maul. Know that. Maul. Running, running, and running, running. Oh, that was a great. Oh yeah, we we beat up that. we beat up this guy. I don't blame you, Mr. Anderson. Mr. Anderson. That Watch was this, ready. She's a wanted fugitive. What? Watch this, ready. <laughs> <laughs> That's my first reaction. It's just like. Hey, your friend is wanted in 75 states. <laughs> Just for... bop him right in the head. Oh there you go. I killed him. <laughs> this this seems like overkill for just some random person. Police log. Kill the man on the street. <laughs> it's like, your your friend is wanted in 38 states for arson and drugs. And then you're just You like... leave them alone. Pink hair. What's up with all the weird hair in this game? Yeah, dystopian society, what can I say? <laughs> it's so dystopian that feminists took over. Well, most people, I think, have normal hair. Yes, like, crom over here, and... Like, this, that's how your hair gets when you don't wash it in, like, three weeks. Um, Frig, who else do we need to talk to? I know there was something in the Ark Mall that we needed to do. No sense of direction. Isn't that, like, every mission... Yeah, we need to... <laughs> oh, we can't go down there, then. Alrighty. Railing, like, geez. But we can't do that. We're a cop. We have to set a good example. <laughs> yeah, we have... That's a good point. This is this game is supposed to be the moral guide. Oh, you just threw a can at someone. No, I just kicked it. Because I didn't care. <laughs> Spencer. Walking by littering is a federal crime. Haha! <laughs> Jaywalking! <laughs> What the frick? See, that's what we need, is just barriers that physically prevent you from crossing the street, unless... Unless... Haha, <laughs> just kidding, unless... Unless... Where the mother frickin' frick do you want to go, dude? Can we Why talk about Five Nights at Freddy's lore? You see, actually, Five Nights at Freddy's... <laughs> it's a very complex lore. I just want to go to Simon a playing FNAF. Actually, I could see the pixels on this jump scare, so it didn't phase me at all. I will tell you that the jump scare st stopped phasing me after a while. I mean, yeah, I, I you played the. Surprised. What do they make those out of? <laughs> Paper mache. 
was the burger place, right? Borger. Borger. A bee's trigger. Yeah, isn't this where you want to go? Try. We this is to... literally, we're literally here, <laughs> buddy. Wait, 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 wait. Line, it, line the camera angle up with the like, thing that he's telling you to go to. Buddy. <laughs> no, like, line it up and then... Hmm, yes. Try. And just line it up with, like... All right. There's that. Try our exclusive border. Just go get the exquisite burger. That's that's what we need. The exclusive burger. I, we're just gonna walk closer over here, I guess. <laughs> wow! Really? <laughs> Strange tentacles. Hmm. Mm. Me gusta. I've seen this one before. <laughs> Rip in peace. H H. <laughs> Thanks, breadstick. No. I used to call this walking the beat. Hilarious. <laughs> Hilarious. I'm so <laughs> I'm so quirky. I'm I just so dive up the funny. stairs and avoid the like gravity. <laughs> avoid Whee! playing this game from the head injuries that that's going to cause. Alright, so freaking let's see if we can go down here now. I might not have just let us down that yeah. Here, wait. We need to stop at some random location and get a thumbnail. Assassination. Swing. It's like snap their neck if you don't deem them worthy of healing. It's the best option, really. Nope. Oh, that doesn't comply with fire regulation standards. That doesn't set a good example for the kids. There's supposed to be exits on each side of the building. I'll help you. Sure, I can help you. Woohoo! <laughs> right, here's where we're supposed to get this cat ready. Literally cartwheeling down the stairs. We just shoot it. <laughs> ready? Closer. Good aim. All right. It's harder. We're to working on it. <laughs> Are we gonna shoot it? Kitty. Kitty. That's boring. It what? was boring. Did we just like throw the cat at him, or what? How did we get back there though fast? All right, so now we need to go to the shopping mall. Imagine Thor's hammer, but it's with your pets. They just throw your pets? Yeah, you throw them, and then you can like hold out your hand, and they start flying back to you. Hmm. Uh. Uh. We. Oh my god. <laughs> we. <laughs> The fastest way to go. It's not the fastest way, it's just the most fun way. <laughs> Shoot random cars. Frick that guy over there. <laughs> Screw you in particular. Bees trigger. Wait, I think we have to go through this crossing zone. Uh, I'm just going to stay go, here. Go, 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 <laughs> Made it. I see this future is so dystopian. The infrastructure Look, it's a Tesla Cybertruck, guys. Kind of is. They it's, predicted it. It's literally better than the Cybertruck. It's like... I mean, I get... boy, what? Mmm. Mmm. Oh, uh, he's late. Excuse me? <laughs> Wait, that's legal. Alright, so stand. I remember... We can play basketball if we want to in here, actually. <laughs> nice. Uh, where's the ball? There it is. Face. No, that's oh. a soccer ball. Ball is life. Watch me hit this sick flip. Ready? If you think about it, ball really is life. Cinderella be like, <laughs> the ball is life, brah. What did Cinderella say when she got to the ball? The haunted dumpster. It's just a cat, if I remember. These people are freaking stupid. Like, what? What kind of police officer are you? Like, yep, yes, ma'am. I'll, I'll check it out. I, I'm sure that this dumpster really is haunted. I'm the mall cop. Ball I'm the port. mall cop. Duh. Are you okay? You just seem to be dying this episode. No, 
It's we're recording this earlier than usual. <laughs> we we just don't know what to do with ourselves at this point. All right, I think this is not the cat actually. Jeez. Let's see. All right. So oh yeah. What you're gonna do? Da da. Yeet. <laughs> Whoa. But guess what? Let's see what happens next time. Whoa! See you later, gamers. Oh, we're fighting now. <laughs>